New South Wales were without some big names for the 2022 edition of State of Origin, but we'll likely see plenty of changes this year with the likes of Lateral Mitchell expected to be available. After missing the 2022 campaign for New South Wales, Tom Tebrovitz looks set to overcome concerns over a groin injury and his fitness. His brother Jake is set to miss the opener, with the manly forward withdrawing due to a lingering calf injury and replaced in the side by Tevita Pengai Jr. Epi Kurosawa's performance in round 12 was enough to see him edge out Damien Cook for the starting hooker position. Jerome Luai has won the race for the number 6 jumper, while Nico Hines set to come off the bench. Lateral Mitchell will return to the back line for the Blues in the 2023 series, while Jos Adoka has completed an early return from an ankle injury, will line up on the wing. Canberra's Hudson Young makes his debut, while Liam Martin has returned from a hamstring injury and has been selected on the bench alongside Cameron Murray, while Tyson Frizzle will return to the side for the first time since 2020. Stephen Crichton and Stefano Utaikamanu have been named in the reserves with Campbell Graham sidelined due to a sternum injury. From the Maroons camp, Colin Ponga and Dane Gagai have been axed by the Maroons in a major selection call from Billy Slater. Rhys Walls is set to earn his origin debut at fullback, while Hemiso Tabua Fido will return in the centres. Jeremiah Nenai's four-week suspension means he will miss the series opener, while Felice Kafusi has also been rubbed out. David Fifita and Tom Gilbert will start in the second rower, with Jai Arrow to come off the bench. Joseph Pali has retired from State of Origin, which will see Lindsay Collins and Tom Flagler earn the starting front row sports. Ruben Cotta and Tino Fa Suomalwai have been named in the bench alongside Jay Arrow.